And you've heard about the controversy over the seals at the children's pool in La Jolla. But tonight, the city is doing something it's never done before, and that brought these protesters out this evening. Tenders reporter Rachel Bianco shows us the group that gathered to oppose a new ban and mourn a San Diego tradition. It is an unusual candlelight vigil, but the people behind me say by blocking the entrance to the children's pool, the city is robbing them of a piece of history. You could hear the waves crashing behind Ryan Sweeney as he sat in quiet protest. He's here on behalf of the San Diego Free Divers. Nearly a dozen supporters surrounded him with candles and rest in peace signs. I am here mourning the loss of a beach that has tremendous history. That history includes decades of fighting between seal lovers and people who want beach access. Now, for the first time, the entrance to the children's pool is locked to the public. I have no problems sharing this beach as has been done throughout history. But problems were captured on this seal cam. The live video feed caught people harassing the seals or scaring them back into the water. This rope barrier was supposed to prevent that from happening. When that didn't work, the city decided to ban people from the beach during the seals' five-month birthing season. The Coastal Commission approved the ban. I think it's really unnecessary. Uh, this, there are also legal issues that uh, they're treading a little new ground. This is the most protected beach. Also, one of the most popular for tourists who will now have to check out the seals from a distance. For us, it makes no difference. Um, seeing them up here, I think we've got a good view. It's enough. This entrance will remain locked until May 15th. Violators could be arrested. Reporting in La Jolla, Rachel Bianco, 10 News.